my name is Oliver Booth and um, I'm part of a show called Wildcard Comedy. It's five of us um, and we all students from UCT. It's a diverse bunch of, um, of guys, the, the, the organizer Dean, Dean Creel, um, who st sort of starts the show off. They do a physical theater piece, uh, which he kind of created, which has got um, some, some mixed responses, but he's a cool dude. He's, he's quite a Hitler with us. He's quite a dictator. He, get, he makes sure like we're in order and you know, we've got to be hitting our deadline. <laughs> <laughs> Skulk, Bezadenhout, uh, he's, he's got a big furry afro, Afrikaans fro, um, and uh, he's, he's a very funny dude, uh, he's mostly kidding around the whole time, um, he's, um, yeah, he's, he's sort of the, the clown quite literally, uh, with that hairdo of, uh, of, the, of the crew and he's always kind of causing, causing a bit of trouble but obviously in, 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 you know, in a good way, not, yeah. Then there's Sean Fickling. A lot of people have trouble saying my surname when they meet me for the first time so I usually say it like this. It's Fickling, like tickling with an F. Which is like fucking but with a tickle. <laughs> and he's doing, actually doing his masters in engineering. So I think he's, uh, you know, it's a surprise package. Uh, that one, but he's also he's also actually a bit of a bit of a clown. Then um, Matthew Elves, uh, who was was also part of the mime in the beginning, and um, he played uh, he sort of became this character at the end, Garden Bibbins, and did musical comedy, um, which is which which I'm sure f well, freaked a few people out, but that was kind of his intention. Yesterday evening. I got drunk on ice cream and I stumbled into an elevator and I got stuck. <laughs> Don't ask me how. Please. He studies theatre and performance at UCT and he's a very talented actor and he loves these, uh, these dark and kind of freaky sort of yet slightly quite humorous uh, roles, you know, kind of freak people out and make them laugh through that. He's, he's a bit like kind of off the mainstream, which I think we all enjoy in him. I went to London, this lady was like, what's your name then, love? I was like, my name is Sip Fogile. She was like, we'll call you Sip then. She shortened my name there and then. Like, my name was not even that hard to pronounce, Sip Fogile. I can understand that my name was uh, uh, ba. <laughs> then she didn't ask me, what's your name then, love? And I said, my name is Abba. I can understand that she went, we'll call you. <laughs> ah, he's, he's, he's great. Uh, I think he's, he's a great dude and I really enjoy his, uh, his stuff. Basically, this year was like an experiment and we were just like at the last minute, let's go to, let's go to Grahamstown. And yeah, just experiment, see what works, see, see what, what, what doesn't. Fool around and, and have fun and, and just, yeah, just sticking, sticking to our guns, sticking to our hearts and, uh, doing our own thing, you know, and not being afraid to, to do it.